What's going on everybody, it's Krennic here and welcome back after a very long break to Realm Royale. To be honest, I took the time off mm, from this game mainly because it got replaced by uh, Subnautica and I'm really I'm really into Subnautica right now, which is why it's been got, uh, it's been on the channel for a majority of the of the films. So I am gonna do Subnautica as much as I can, but I can't replace with any other games. But as you can see, we've got no forges because we have limited time event that uh, disables all the forges. So the only thing. We can rely on this now it's what we get from the chest and what we get from the players we kill i know this is a little bit random and the chances are uh, that in a late game somebody's gonna have a good loot and us it's just a matter of luck but we'll see how it's gonna come out it's it's a little a little bit like a challenge basically don't use the forge right i, uh, I chose the mage because uh bolt stuff it seems to be dropping quite a lot uh, plus a uh, mage as a uh, default uh, movement ability is obviously so so uh, I reckon this is the best ability in terms of like trying to reposition gain high ground and gain an advantage over opponent I think this is the ability to go so I think mage will be very good for the uh, for this limited time event we got ourselves a slug rifle already so that gives us a little bit advantage I might have said this quite some time ago that a uh, slug rifle is like the the weapon of the weapons because it, uh, it can be used for long and short range and it has quite a decent damage as well okay what's here CC okay see shards are becoming absolutely useless but I'm just sharding my items so nobody else can get them so stuff like Grey pistols or like grey SMGs. I'm just gonna leave that out on the floor because there might be some more important stuff to uh, disenchant. Oh, that's nice. Okay, that's nice. Passive repair, that's really nice. I'm better healing. I hear a player. It's pushing. I think he's above me. Let's get him. Repairing armor. Oh my god, he saw me. Oh wait, mate. The fog sets in. Okay, that's good. Got him. Nice, good stuff. See, you now this is the problem because uh, I've got quite plenty of shards, but I cannot forge. So, like I said, shards are just becoming useless now. And in limited time events, everybody is a player, so whoever I come across, it's probably going to be a player. 
which makes it obviously a little bit harder. And that way chances I'm gonna win are also lower. It's difficult for me to like pick the place where I want to go since the forges are no, no longer active. But all I've got left to do is just open as many chests and maybe I'll get something good, like Bear's Rifle. Yeah, I'm not sure whether that was a good decision. It's the chances you're gonna get something good are actually really, really low. But once you get it, you are becoming like uh, one of the most powerful people in the game. But it's all the matter of luck. And obviously opening chests, especially in a late game, gives away your position. But at the same time, there is always a chance you might get something better, something that might potentially change the outcome of the game. Again, the forges aren't on, so the chances you're gonna find somebody across the fields rather than around the forge areas is higher. So I just got, just gotta keep my eyes open. Somebody is definitely there. there. There is a reason why the drop is there. It's because somebody is gonna come from the other side and get it. Yeah, somebody already got it. Trying to fight you, little clucker. Oh, legendary revolver, that's nice. Ghost walk, okay, okay. Uh, School of Chaos, nice, okay. Because if somebody is, we have someone to hunt for. Is he going for me or is he going? Why are you up there? Can't get me. You can't get me. Can't get me. Okay, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Come on then. Come on then. What are you gonna do, man? Come on. Oh, I thought, I thought that's actually gonna get him. He's not in the zone. Fog is gonna push him out. I've got the advantage. What is he? Get him skull. Okay, get him before he gets the high ground. Good stuff. Now we run. That's a good moment to finish him off. Got him. He didn't have a, he didn't have a, such a good loot. So this is exactly what I said. There is a chance you might get a good loot, and or there is a chance you will get a very crappy loot. Like he has a legendary. Them school of chaos are just not connecting today. Nobody here with me now. Good stuff. So now I'm actually gonna take this. Okay, the people might be coming from there, people might be coming from there, there's three people left. 
I'm exposed from every angle. My house is in a very visible spot. People are gonna be pushing from that way as well. He has advantage because he's already there. Okay, people are fighting there. Okay, we're gonna wait for, for a third party and then we're gonna engage. Okay, what is this guy? Okay, this guy's healing up and getting himself ready. He's behind a statue, I think. Did he see me? Okay, we're gonna fall back. Fall back, fall back, fall back. Okay, he has a sword, just gotta keep an eye on this. He has a turret. You can't push me from that way. 1v1. Come on, skulls. Even though I have not played this game for like a month, I can still kick ass. <laughs> no forge challenge completed with six skills, which is alright. It could be better, but still, after such a long break, I still managed to kill some people, so I'll take this episode as absolutely successful. So yeah guys, it's been a good one. All the social media down below. Expect more Rum Royale content coming up pretty soon because we had a break from it So we need to start kicking ourselves in again make sure we get the content we need but for now guys It's been a good one. I'm Krennic. Stay safe, and I'll see you in the next episode